Hello, uh, I am Lee Johnson, this is Books Know Best, um, and this video has a bit of a sad tone, but I wanted to talk to you about something. So, I watched, I think it was Bookish and Nerdy, yes, it was, I think it was Bookish and Nerdy, um, I watched her video, um, it's called Dorothy Must Die and Full Fathom 5, um, and she talked about um, Full Fathom 5, which is a book packaging company, I think it's called, um, and they distribute books, I think, and, you know, they work on the, I think they, I think a book publish, a book packaging company works on the, like, creation side of a book or something, I'd, I'm not too sure, anyway, so she said that Full Fathom 5 is owned by an ex-author called James Frey, who wrote a book called A Million Little Pieces, which was supposedly about his real life. Um, and then it was revealed that he said that he, unfortunately, he lied um, about it being about his life. Um, and I think he was dropped from the publishing company that published A Million Little Pieces. Um, and yeah, apparently James Frey owns Full Fathom 5, which um, book packaged, which packaged uh, Dorothy Must Die for Harper Collins and Daniel Page, um, and she said that she was really sad about it because she read the book and absolutely loved it as I did. I think it's, I think it's an absolutely amazing book. Um, but yeah, she said that she was really upset about it, um, and I understood her point of view. But then I just wanted to give you my point of view because I also think that. Whether or not James Frey and Full Fathom 5 are corrupt and seedy, um, it doesn't detract from the fact that Danielle Page herself wrote this book. Um, and, you know, Bookish and Nerdy, I don't know her real name, I'm sorry, but Bookish and Nerdy did say that she, she started to doubt whether the story was an idea by Danielle Page or by James Frey. Um, and she felt really upset about that because she loved the book. Um, and like I said, I love this book. And I, I, I mean, it's an amazing book. And I don't think that the fact that Full Fathom 5 packaged this book, I don't think that's a bad thing. And I don't think that this was an idea by James Frey. I think this is a Danielle Page idea. Um, but I think we'll know more. Um, when more books are published um, and hopefully the other books will be just as amazing as this one and it will be a fantastic trilogy because those are my hopes for this franchise um, yeah so that's what I wanted to say I mean I agree with I agree with Bookish and Nerdy you know I, I don't agree with the fact that James Frey may have come up with this idea I think it is Danielle Page idea and you know I also want to believe it's a Danielle Page idea because I want to support her because the world she created and the book itself is just fantastic and if it was her own idea we should support her and yeah I mean I didn't read the articles that Bukasha Nerdy left links for um, but you know those are my views and whether or not they're right or wrong um whether or not you agree with these views, you know, they don't really bother me. I mean, the fact that it's James Frey and Full Fathom 5 doesn't really bother me at all. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to get that out and tell you. Um, yeah, so thank you for watching this video. Um, if you have any comments, any views on this, please comment below. Um, and I'll leave a link for the original video in the, da in the description box so you can go check that out. Because I think it is informative, and it is quite touching, um, and a little bit sad. But, yeah. And also, if you like this video, please like. Um, and if you want to, please subscribe. Um, and yeah, I will see you again soon. Thank you for watching, and happy reading, and have a wonderful day, whatever you are up to.